table. I'd throw it across the room and, and make a crash. Don't sit. Look at the chair. Don't sit at a table that Jesus would flip. Don't sit at a table that Jesus would flip. He flipped out in Mark chapter 11. He threw the tables of the money changers and he said, My house should be called a house of prayer for the nations, but you have made it a den of thieves. The thief comes to steal, kill, and destroy. Jesus said, But I have come that you might have life and have it more. But he said, Avoid them. For they that are such serve not the Lord Jesus. They're fake. They're imposters. They're frauds. They're imitators. But what do they serve? What do they serve? Their own belly. Their own belly. Their own belly. Their own belly. They're gluttons. They're drunks. They're pigs. They're animals. Their own belly. They're assaulters. And they're bulliers. And they're braggers. And they're boasters. And they're liars. And they're cheaters. They serve their own belly. And by good words and fair speeches. Oh, they've got good oratory. They're good speakers. They're good singers. They'll flatter you. They'll butter you up. The promise is the But when you give them your money, your hard-earned money, they get rich and you get poor. Good words, fair speeches, false brethren, and lying wonders. And by good words and fair speeches, they deceive the hearts of the simple. And that's what's going on today. I'm done. You're listening. There's great preachers out there today, but they don't preach it right. Oh, they're great in their aura. Stephen Furtick is one of the best preachers I've ever heard. I'll sit there and listen to Stephen for hours. He is a genius. He is a great Young preacher. Not so young anymore. He's in his 40s. He's great. A lot of them. I could name a bunch of their names. But they're not preaching truth. It's not how you preach it. It's what you preach. It's not so much your delivery. It's your content. It took me 50 years to get it right. Bless God. Glory to God. I got it right tonight. Every head bowed. Every eye closed. Father, we thank you for this opportunity. Another opportunity to stand with your holy, inspired, infallible, and inerrant word. Glory to God for what you've done. Now, God, I pray that you convict my audience of sin, righteousness, and judgment. And you draw them and bring them to the bleeding side of Calvary. And I'll ask it in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. There are some of y'all, you've never made Jesus the Lord of your life. Or you did and you backslid. Like Saddleback Church, you, you backslid. It's time to come home. I'm coming home. Coming home. Never more to roam. Open wide thine arms of love. Lord, I'm coming home. Why? Because it's almost midnight. Tick tock, it's almost midnight. It's almost midnight. The midnight cry. At the midnight cry, we'll be going home when Jesus steps out on the cloud to call his children. It's midnight cry. It's midnight cry. It's midnight cry. It won't be long till Jesus comes. It won't be long till he appears. It won't be long till all fear is gone. It won't be long till Jesus comes. <laughs> it won't be long, so keep holding on. It won't be long till Jesus comes. It won't be long till we'll be going home. It won't be long, so keep holding on. It won't be long, so stay strong. It won't be long till Jesus comes. It won't be long till he appears. It won't be long till all fear is gone. <laughs> I don't do many original songs, but glory to God, that shot off the presses from heaven from the Holy Ghost. That's a Mike Dollar original. Praise God, praise God, praise God for the moving 
an operation. That's a spiritual song. Psalms, hymns, spiritual songs, singing and making melody in your heart to the Lord. And you don't ever know what, what God's going to get out. Oh my God, time! it's time to get right with God. I want you to pray this prayer and mean it with all your heart. Dear God in heaven, I'm a sinner. That's it, repeat it. I'm a sinner. I can't save myself. But I believe that Jesus died for me on the cross. And I repent of my sin. And I ask you to wash me in the blood of the Lord Jesus Christ. Forgive me. And I dedicate, consecrate the rest of my life to you. Each minute of each day, of each hour, of each week, of each month, of each year, of each decade. And for the rest of my life, Jesus is Lord. Come into my heart today, Lord Jesus. I accept you as my personal Savior. I make you the Lord of my life. Now God, fill me with the Holy Spirit. Baptize me in the Holy Ghost. Lead me and guide me. And I pray it, Father, in Jesus' name. Amen, amen. And there is rejoicing in heaven. <laughs> in the presence of the angels over one sinner. It wasn't this better today than wasting time on your wireless and your idle phone. Hearing the Word of God is better. The Word of God is better than tech. Glory to God. Glory to God. The Word of God is greater than text. The Word of God is greater than wireless. Thanks for being with me today. Pastors, invite me to preach in your brick and mortar churches for conferences, camp meetings, special speaker conventions. You have not because you ask not. Text or call me 24-7, 703-405-1942. 703-405-1942. That's how you can schedule your meeting in person, brick and mortar in your church. Uh, if you want to send an offering, and I think God's leading hundreds of thousands of my followers to do that. PayPal.me slash forward slash Mike Dial. PayPal.me forward slash Mike Dial. Venmo at Evangelist Mike Dial. Or the easiest way, send a check. Send a check with your best offering to Mike Dial 4404. That's Mike Dial 4404 Southwest 8th Place. Cape Coral, two words, Florida 33914. Let me say that again. Mike Dial 4404, Southwest 8th Place, Cape Coral, Florida, 33914. I love you guys so much. And the next time we get together, we're going to have another great Pentecostal prayer and healing service. But, but before I go, let me just, if you're hurting right now real bad, I should stretch out your hand toward me right now. Believe God. Hallelujah. I try to close, but there's the... No, the uh, God has other plans. I'm, okay, absolutely. It's your service. It's not mine. Right now, I feel my left hand's tingling. The hair on my left hand is standing up. It's tingling right now with the anointing. There it is. Just jump in the river of God. There it is. Be healed in the name of Jesus. Whatever the sickness, whatever the disease, whatever the oppression, the bondage, through the smoking or porn, fornication, whatever it is, cancer, AIDS, tuberculosis, COVID-19, sugar, diabetes, hypertension, dementia, Alzheimer's, in Jesus' name, receive your healing. Oh, there it is. God is healing the sick. Just say, Lord, I receive it. Oh, there's my right hand going crazy now. Now both hands. I'm sorry, Southern Baptist. But when you feel the power of God like this, you just got to pray in tongues. You want the interpretation. Here it is. I got it right now from the Lord. God says right now, I am healing the sick. I am, I am pouring you. I am throwing you into the pool. Jump into the pool. The Spirit of God, forget the movies. And jump into the moving river of mine. Right here, there's a river. Be healed. Handelehi salabotala bakata. And the power of cigarettes and the power of drinking and the power of porn and the power of perversion and the power of the lying tongue are broken, are broken, are broken by the name above every name and by the blood of the Lord Jesus Christ. Be ye set free. Be ye every generational curse is broken in the name of Jesus by the power of Almighty God. Okay, to the top of your head to the soles of your feet. Receive the anointing. Signs, wonders, miracles are flowing from Calvary. Flowing from the altar. The river flows from the altar. Receive it. In the name of Jesus. Send in your testimonies. Keep praying. If you're mad at somebody, if you're holding grudges or bitterness or unforgiveness, forgive them. And that blockage will stop and your healing will come. That's a word from God. I love you. Remember, Jesus is still Lord. 
And Jesus is still your answer. Amen.